Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to this OACE semifinals game. My name is Kyler Drake. Here, joined alongside with Colby Gray. <laughs> Colby, how are we feeling today? We are feeling great. Like you said, it is the semifinals match of the OACE here, where your hometown Southeaster is going to be facing SNU Southern Nazarene University. Number two seed taking on the number three seed. Southeastern is just one win away from qualifying for that for that grand finals match mm -hmm. in a uh, Swasu on Saturday. Um, this Saturday. I, this Saturday. And I, I do believe they have the, they have the chance to go. 100%. Like we've seen all all year round, especially uh, in the mid-year, they really came together and chemistry-wise, yeah. they were really able to click and find their ways around other teams, especially like we've seen earlier in the year. Dawson sometimes had to step down from he the scoring did. position and be assisting and putting their his teammates in and, position and to with score. with that being said, also like people like Bender, um, right. who at the beginning of the, of the season played more like a Dennis Rodman type role and was right. there for rebounds and passes. But uh, as we've seen here in the last few games, he's actually kind of turned into a threat, um, mm -hmm. both on the offensive and defensive side. Um, yes. So, Colby, will you just uh, break down our, our team for us? Absolutely. As you can see here, we have Crimson, Mr. Christian Vining, DJ Dawson, and Bender is Aaron. As you can see, Crimson is uh, Grand Champ 3, DJ is Supersonic Legend, and Bender is also Grand Champ 3. Very experienced players. These guys have been on the grind here, especially lately in the uh, postseason of the OACE, as we should be. Yeah, and they're looking forward. Uh, looking on the other side of the bracket a little bit. Um, so we are playing. We're going into this game against the number three ranked SNU, mm -hmm. who they just picked up a win last week against uh, Northwestern. Um, and then on the other side, we have, um, I believe it's the number one OCU versus um, OSU, mm -hmm. um, which is also going to be a really close game. Um, Southeastern has beaten OSU in the past. Um, and then the only really loss we have this season comes to the hand of uh, OCU. Right. So both teams are really much of a threat to Southeastern. Um, Absolutely. As And like you said, we are, especially in this game and what the plan is throughout the rest of the OAC playoffs, they're going to look to stay aggressive like they have yeah. all year. So many shots on goal and opportunities to score is what Southeastern looks for. Just pushing and keeping the ball on the opponent's side of the field is what they want to do, and they have been doing that. And last week, we saw a little bit of trouble with that with uh, RSU. Mm -hmm. They put three defenders back in the goal, and they wanted Southeastern to take... They wanted to shoot themselves out pretty much to where they could get them out of boost and really rotate out and get uh, pretty much cherry picks on, yeah, on, yeah, the, on I mean, the other end there. But uh, in today's matchup against SNU, they have a really, really good team and especially a very good player, Briss, which he's been in the top 100. Uh, I, I, yeah, I believe he was. Seasons. I believe he was ranked number 54 in the world at one point. Yes. Um, really good player. Um, DJ, who is um, captain of this Rocket League team, says that him and Briss are actually like really close friends or really good friends. Um, so he's looking forward to the mm -hmm. more friendly side of this matchup. Yep. Yeah. Um, but it is going to be close nonetheless. Lots lots of talent here this evening. Yeah, definitely. Lots and lots of talent. So be sure to stay tuned on that. And if you want to keep up with this, mm -hmm. you should check us out on our socials at SE Sports HQ on Instagram and Twitter. 
it'd be greatly appreciated. We put a lot of our stuff out there to make sure you guys know when we're going live and when we have videos and highlight videos. Highlight videos. Those are new and they just came out. Mm -hmm. um, the Rocket League one actually like just came out recently. Yep. Just got that put um, together. The best season highlights from your 2023 fall season. So make sure to go check that out. Give it some love. And again, thank you so much for being here tonight. We cannot do this job without no, you cannot. at home. So stay tuned as we look into this semifinal round of, of the OACE playoffs. Rocket League playoffs. Kyler, send us out. Peace out.
And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the semifinals of OACE. Here we are in the game number one. Um, unlike the quarterfinals, the semifinals is actually the best of seven. Um, as we start here with, we're deep into um, SNU territory, but now we're back into Southeastern's territory. Um, as you can see, there's Briss straight off. Um, we can already tell that he's going to be a threat down low. Um, He's already getting back, and his rotations are really well. Mm. <clears throat> and they're just applying that early pressure to the southeastern side of the ball. 50-50 coming in there. Mm. Like, Just like you were saying, Kyler, if Brisk can get... Ooh, and there's a demo by DJ. And they were looking... Brisk can take control of the ball early to get many goals. And oh, well wow. defended by Bender. Here comes Brisk and DJ up top. Oh, oh wow. And there's Brisk, Brisk. is going to get the early goal off the assist from Lando. Um, as you can see, since Briss is a lot of the star of the show, um, these uh, these teammates that he has, um, Lando, um, they're really good at putting him in the position that they need to and create him opportunities to get the ball and so he can throw it down the spike. And just like that, Bender's going to kind of do the same thing to DJ, who's going to get back to Bender, just barely going to be out. Oh, they're out of rotation oh, on the Chris, goal. Oh, oh, but he just couldn't get it. But DJ's back there. And Briss defended well. And again, looking to take control out of the hands of Briss. Like you see his teammates, there's DJ disrupting that pass up to Briss. Now it's a two-on-two -two coming back with rotations and a and a demolition on Crimson. He's going to look to oh, get it. Oh, oh, Bender trying Briss. to get it to himself. Oh, Just wow. Couldn't. Again, an Chris amazing player. Crimson's going to be back, though. Crimson looking to set something up for DJ, but just not able to do it. Bender going up top for the aerial, setting looking it up off the backboard. But nobody's there. Looking to rotate back for boost. And his crimson goes up top, and in the in the Looking, goal oh, is Kenny. And Bender's got to get back. He is going to meet it. That was a good play there. And Bender's going to get the uh, the demo. Um, mm -hmm. As you can see, that it, it looks like they're going to have to um, try to <laughs> limit the amount of ball control um, from Briss's side even more if they can. Right. Um, ooh, a, ooh, a kill shot there from Kenny, but just couldn't go. And another demolition from Crimson. And here it is, Briss with the ball himself. Bender and DJ rotated back, trying to disrupt anything he could. There's DJ trying to take control. Back to Bender. And the clear from Bender. And here we go out to the races out front. It is disrupted by Briss again, and Crimson going up top for it. Passing it upside to DJ. Bender looking to rotate back into goal for something, but they can't get it. Ariel up top by Briss. Bender looking to disrupt. Oh! Good disruption. DJ's going to hit it out. And DJ's going up top for an aerial. Oh, and again, defended by Briss. Crimson there for the oh, rebound. Oh. DJ can't put it in. Man, they wanted that one. That was a little too close for comfort on SNU's side. But Southeastern still in good position here, as anything could happen. Looking to set up something off the backboard, but couldn't. Crimson again, looking on this right side to take control out of Briss' hands. And there's Bender with a shot on goal. Oh, wow. It's going to be broken up by there by Kenny. Um, but DJ's going to get another shot on goal. Mm. Briss was able to get a hand on it. It's going to be hit now to that outside corner. And with three rotated back already, Bender, all, all three SC players on this left side here, looking to maybe piece something together as the demolition comes in on Bender. And DJ up to oh, Crimson. Wow. Oh, but disrupted. But Bender's going to be there to hit it back over. And another demolition. Man, Crimson just keep on getting those demos there on uh, on Kenny. It's almost like every single time. <laughs> and up top goes Kenny. Briss again with control of the ball. DJ looking oh, wow, for a shot, pass. but just couldn't go. Man, they SC's had great opportunities, especially setting it up to themselves to have shots yeah. on goal here. And there's oh, DJ! Like that. DJ's got to get that one. Speaking, he, you he, shall receive. He said, Briss, I got you one. I owe you one right there. <clears throat> and there it is. Crimson off the backboard. Good to pass. DJ. Better finish. Love to see that. And that'll tie it up with 108 to go here in this first round of the best of seven. Kickoff's going to be one there by Southeastern. Benner's going to take it up himself, trying to get it to Crimson, but he was just bumped out the way. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and, and then Briss is going to get the demo on DJ. Ooh, Crimson with a oh, shot himself. Crimson the, wanted that one. Bender off the backboard, maybe. Here comes DJ. And there it is. Back-to-back back by DJ. 
allowing Southeastern to go up two to, to one. Zero. Or yeah, two to one. Sorry. <laughs> that demolition right there on, I believe, I can't remember who it was. It was Kenny Briss and uh, Lando. Lando, yeah. yeah. That demolition on Lando was very crucial there for TJ to, to have a wide open goal. goal. Yeah. As he recovers on the tip off, Lando looking to try to clear, but can't. Briss on the back wall there, looking to take it himself. He aerials. Oh, this wow. Could be bad. He's just going over everybody. Oh, he and almost is going to get that save. Good wow. pinch there. That's how you can tell Briss is just an amazing player by taking it all yeah. the way himself. And the disruption by DJ looking to keep it on SNU side with just a oh. 20 seconds left. This could be huge. It's out bumping left and right. Control. DJ now. Ooh. Ooh. Little self play. Here's Crimson. Crimson. Anything could happen. Briss off the backboard. And all Southeastern really has to do is just make sure that ball hits the ground. Yep, keep it keep like it low. That. And there it is. Game number one. Gonna go to your Savage Storm. <clears throat> Man, what great yeah, that, plays that, on that, both sides. That was close. Wow. As you can see, Briss struck there early, letting SNU go up one. And Southeastern got a little bit scared there, but they kept to their game plan and just a bunch of shots on goal. As you could see, six apiece there by DJ and Crimson, just keeping keeping SNU at bay and not allowing any momentum to go ahead. And that'll bring us to round number two. As here we go on the kickoff, a little bit of a fake out. Oh, wow. And DJ will end up with it. As SNU looking to clear. Ooh, Kenny going up there with DJ. Couldn't get much. Bender, good a, good, there by Bender. a good 50-50 there ends up in SC's favor. As Briss going up top himself. DJ looking to take it. And a shot maybe. That was a good rotation Kenny. there by Crimson. Way to get back to the goal um, and set yourself. That way you're not in a position that you didn't want to be in. Southeastern faces some early pressure. They're looking to pinch oh. off the floor. And there it is. Not able to be. Uh, like SNU wanted out in Crimson the middle field. Meet him. Good anticipation there by Crimson once again. Mm -hmm. They have to play. They have to play to SNU's weaknesses. Like we said, again, looking to disrupt anything that Briss will do as DJ and Kenny going up on this right side. Kenny will whiff, and that gives DJ enough. Oh, but he doesn't have gonna, any boost He's going to knock Briss out the way. Um, I know that that's also been really crucial in this game plan for Southeastern today. Um just by limiting the uh, ball control by Briss, mm -hmm. um, that also means bumping into him and causing some demos as well. Right. Um, Ooh, you see DJ up there on that aerial looking, taking himself. Good. Oh, and Bender tried to get the demo there on Briss to get him out of the goal, but he just couldn't quite connect. Staying heavily on SNU side here later in this round is Bender, again, looking to get control himself, maybe set something up for DJ oh, coming wow. behind, but it is contested by Kenny. Crimson will come underneath and try to take control as SNU will clear and DJ up top. They're gonna meet with each Lando. other. And again, DJ and Briss fighting it out up top there. DJ looks, ooh, might can take control of it. Looking get back to Bender. But Bender can't handle it. As Lando looking for a shot on goal. A good save there by Crimson. And out in front. Looking to set something up for maybe in a center. Oh, Bender looking to center it up. But now DJ will have control of it. Again, heavily defended by SNU, not allowing any more shots. And nobody's rotated back. This could be bad, but it's okay. <laughs> and as you can tell, uh, can, like, since the last time that SNU met Southeastern, um, both teams have come a super Good long way. Good shot by DJ. Sorry to interrupt Just like you, I was saying, both teams have <laughs> came a super long way. I mean, the last time we played them, um, Southeastern did win 3-0 did win and o, um, with a score of 1-0 and o, and then 2-1 and then 4-0. Um, but this time, I'm feeling a closer a closer set of games. It is. Um, very low scoring. But yeah. Good fake out by SC there. Ooh. <laughs> that was a good save there by Crimson as DJ picked up that demo there on Lando. And Binner's going to be the only one back. Ooh, Brist Ooh. looking to take it himself, but he can't. Crimson going to try to interrupt as DJ. They got to get it out of Southeastern Territory as DJ looking to take it himself with a little bit of boost. DJ is met by Briss, but only one rotated back. Bender could oh, do something here. Oh, oh, but DJ but got right in the way. DJ's head. It happens. People get in the way sometimes. Right off the windshield. And then here we go. As two SNU players are rotated back, Kenny looks at 50 50 with DJ, and it'll be pawed up. And there's Crimson on the back. Bender wrote. Oh, Bender just missed it a little bit. He was in good center position there. 
But now here's Briss. Again, Crimson and DJ looking to disrupt it. Again, up top. Here's Bender looking to push it out in front. Good, Good center, demolition, and it's demo. all free. Four South going to take that one off the assist from Bender. Um, so, Colby, before, before the game, I had a chance to talk with our boys. Um, and what would be your go-to hype song? Go-to hype song. I don't know. I'd say Inner Sandman by Metallica. See, I'm I'm a big uh, Seven Nation Army kind of guy. Seven Nation Army kind of guy. Um, that that's my jam. But uh, according to our team, um, they all had very different opinions on what their uh, go-to hype up song would be. Um, DJ's was I Know by Travis Scott. Ooh. Cri Christian's was Walk wow. Em Down. Sorry to interrupt you, Kyle. Nah, I mean, here we are. Look at this take by Brisk. Just soloed on two. Again, good, yeah. good gather and good demolition. He positioned his car right in the middle of where DJ was defending and took it in himself with 1.30 to go. Southeastern still with a little bit of breathing room. But here we go. Again, back to the hype songs. Oh, like yeah. We were talking. Uh, <laughs> Crimson's was walk him down. And then Bender said that um, his is money for nothing, but he said that it's, it's not good until 1 minute 30 exactly. <laughs> he said that's the point that you have to go to um if you're listening to it so let us know in the comments what uh what your favorite hype song is and as we get back to a little bit of gameplay Bruce here he's gonna pick up that demo there Ooh, oh good DJ! Save by dj but another shot opportunity coming in from lando but just couldn't capitalize as one minute love left to remaining see that in southeastern territory again good defended save by, there by crimson, crimson. It's a good shot on Goldo by lando and he's gonna get a pinch Ooh. But Bender's going to be there that time to save it. Ooh, good save by DJ. Somebody's got to get back. Crimson, Again, Crimson was there. Just taking oh, turns. It's a scary. free open goal by DJ. And there it is. Oh! Of the assist from Crimson that time. So you can hear the communication in there. Christian was saying uh, about how good this uh, Southeastern defense is right now. They all had a save. Mm -hmm. um, almost like five saves in a row. Yeah, took turns yeah. on defense. Coordinated and communicated Rotation, well. that's what it was. As you can see, Briss is going to win the tip off there for SNU. <clears throat> As again, oh. Southeastern relying on the aggressiveness of SNU just to open up a hole and really, like we said, push it forward to get another comfortable goal, yeah. leaving Southeastern in a three to one scenario with just 20 seconds left. Play this smart, and you have game two in the bag. SNU is in a difficult position here, looking for anything Good they can pinch get. There. But we got 10 seconds left. DJ looking to maybe keep it up himself. Going to contest by Kenny. And there's oh, there's Chris another pitch, though. Out in front. Nothing All they got to do is spike it. And there is the... Oh, almost. Here comes DJ. Anything on the ground is what Southeastern yeah, wants. Yeah, and just like that. Is. Game number two is going to be closed out. And your Savage Storm is going to take that over the Crimson Storm. Mm -hmm. What a defensive take right yeah. there at the end. Southeastern, again, like we've seen, was able to rotate with... Again, saves on goal four, yeah, four. one and one. Just rotated around and was able. And yeah, to as you can see there, we anything away. Crimson had four saves by himself. Um, and Briss actually had four shots on goal mm -hmm. by himself. So, um, fairly uh, matched up there. Yes. Um, shutting everything down from SNU as we go into game number three. And Southeastern has a momentum. It looks like. And here we go. A little bit of fake off. Oh wow! Fake on the kickoff. Bender couldn't take it himself. But man, what a good play. As Crimson looked to rotate it back, setting something up for DJ here. It's on the center, defended well by three SNU players. As DJ looks to gain control, contested it up by Lando. There. Up top, here comes Bender. Oh, a little pogo to himself, it. maybe. There's DJ. Keeping him up, up high off the backboard. And they're going to have to rotate back. Bender with a free oh, shot, wow. maybe. Oh, but Lando's going to save that one. And here's DJ, contested by Lando. Oh, Ooh. that was so close. <laughs> that was. And like we said, Bender has definitely come out of his shell this year. Yeah, the fact definitely. Oh, but Bender whiffs, looking for the uh, looking for the clear, but just can't. A demolition on Lando by Crimson. Again, rotating out, and here comes DJ out in front. Crimson looking up to go the right side. Oh, trying to interrupt. Wow. Oh, but Briss, well defended. Just underneath Lando, and Briss was there to say, I got you, and pick him up. Mm -hmm. As Bender with the contest, looking to get it out to the center of DJ, contested by Lando. And up off the backboard, anything could go here. Crimson looking to get some boost. Center it up for DJ. A pass Back off. Back to Crimson. One, two, good. Let's go. 
Wow, good, the, good the back and passes. forth passes. Amazing. Love to see that. As you DJ see. to Crimson. Just like that. Right over Briss. Wow. Kyler, great play there. That's what I'm saying. <clears throat> really That's tough to yeah, handle. Yeah, that is. Especially a one defender back. And here we go. SC will go up one to zero, 350 early in this game. As we can see, again, SNU with three players back. Crimson Bender looking. Whoa. Oh, wow. Scary shot there. Oh, Anybody wow. in the center? Wow, SNU couldn't capitalize on that, but there's Briss, DJ and taking Briss it away. DJ. As Lando looks to recuperate a little bit, here's Kenny, contested by Crimson. Let's see, and Bender's gonna get that one up. Briss gonna take the aerial himself. A little bit of, ooh, <laughs> a little bit of sauce <laughs> on Made me a little one. nervous right there. <laughs> little bit of sauce on that one, but here we go. Southeastern, again, not letting any, any shots through. As Bender oh, wants to wow. take it. Oh, wow. That was a good save there by Kenny. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting back to his teammates. Great contest by Bender. Yeah. And up top goes DJ. Great things happen when we get up top and out front. And there's Bender looking to center it up on the right side. But Kenny able. Ooh, a little pass to DJ here. Oh, but well saved again by Briss. Southeastern's done a great job of communicating and setting up for one another. Through two defenders, there goes Bender. Crimson going to take it here. DJ is roaming somewhere close. Oh, Look at wow. it, it himself. Let's go, DJ. And there's DJ. As you can see, Azuri's got 308 on his score. Um, one goal um, with the three shots, one assist, and one save. <clears throat> Momentum yeah. is flowing. Here we go, 230. With two to zero, this is a scary spot for SNU. Again, Southeastern has the game advantage yeah. and has a score advantage as Crimson can do something here off the backboard with Bender right alongside him as Briss and Lando look to pair up and get something going out front, but DJ is there to disrupt, saying no. And Kenny's the only one back on goal as the other two rotate back for SNU. And here comes Briss, shadowing on defense as Crimson oh, is good, good save by save. Bender. Lando looking for the rebound, trying to center it up. Here comes Crimson's Briss. Crimson's going to get that one. To now, Bender now. On the Bender, but oh, well good saved save. by Kenny. Wow, great save. This defensive side of the ball on both teams is really through the roof right now. Yes, it is. As Bender's going to hit that up. Looking to get it to Crimson, but it's just not going to meet him there. Crimson's going to have to rotate back really quickly. Good disruption <clears throat> there. Looking to pass front to DJ. DJ couldn't Ooh. get the handle on the aerial, but there's Bender. Tried to set something up on the backboard, but couldn't. Crimson again on shadowing defense. As we see Lando looking to disrupt. Kenny up top. DJ looking for the rebound. Oh, oh but wow. that's, couldn't handle it. Right a little way. bit. And there's Briss. Good. Good, good take there. Yes, good great take. take. They capitalized on DJ's mistake there. A little bit of a whiff as we've seen. And out front, Briss had all the boost he needed to take one home. As that will shorten the score up just a little bit. SNU 1, Southeastern 2 with 120 left to go in game number three. As here we go on the kickoff. Met in the middle, but ends up in SC's favor. Bender looking to set something off the oh, back wow. of Crimson. Oh, he tried to take it himself, oh, but yeah. couldn't. As SNU will again rotate back in the control of Briss. And nobody's back. Crimson looking. Get there quickly. He's there he is. He's going to be able to save that one. It's a good shot on goal there by Briss. Mm -hmm. a scary territory for SC, yeah. but DJ able to clear as, again, contested by Briss with no boost left. Trying to take it himself, but Crimson will push out front. And something, ooh, almost oh. a self goal there. Good shot by Bender, but contested by Lando. As Crimson will look to center it Good up to pass. DJ. Oh, but DJ couldn't capitalize, but on the rebound, something Christian can't go. tried to. And they got to rotate back. As there's only 30 seconds left. Uh, SNU still able to tie this, this game up. Mm -hmm. 30 seconds remaining. Hot and, hot and heavy here for Crimson SNU. hitting that one down. To Bender, who's looking to get it back to Crimson. Oh, and Briss going to hit it out as there's 13 seconds left. Keeping it on SNU's side. Again, all Southeastern has they to do is spike seconds. it. They just got to play the ball down. Oh, and that's bad they're for SNU. Oh, but they are able to keep it up with one second left. Briss. Good spike there. As now we're entering game number four. 
and this is win or go home for SNU right now. One more game. One more Tyler. game until the grand finals. Hopes are alive I here can smell it. I can smell it. As wow. You can see there, Bristow with an outstanding score of 777 um, with six saves by himself. Um, amazing, amazing, even though the stats really don't line up that much. But still, a great game, again, by both yeah. teams. Taking some time here to recuperate. SNU has to make a miracle run. They have to win four games in a row here to get the best. It's not impossible. It's, it's not, not impossible. impossible. But still, a this lot of pressure. This is a must-watch eSports, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Yes, it Don't is. Don't forget, if you're, uh, if you're liking what you see right now, um, go and uh, like and subscribe. <clears throat> So I believe we're having a little bit of technical difficulties. Yes. There we go. Looks like oh. DJ and Briss. There we go. People are starting to come back in. Okay. As there we there we have it. Ladies and gentlemen. Having a little bit of technical difficulties here as the packet loss. Yeah. And some internet issues. Hopefully everything at home is still good. Really just died. Ladies and gentlemen, please stay tuned because we had a little, yeah. little, little bit little of bit server of issues. Uh, difficulties. So we are back again. A little bit of momentum change. Yeah, I don't know. That was a long pause. It's but okay. All the, all the cars had time to, to, to get their gas all the way filled back yeah, up. Oil change. Yeah. <laughs> windows, windows cleaned. Tires aired up. Changed those windshield wipers. You yeah. Know, but it's all good. As there we go. Everyone looking to load back in, and there it is. And here we go. Win or go home now for SNU. All the momentum is in Southeastern's favor. Absolutely. They win this. Grand finals, Grand baby. Grand finals. And here we go. On the kickoff. Kick goes in Southeastern's favor. Up top, Kenny looking to gain control, but Crimson there to the contest with Briss. But Briss able to gain control as Bender rotating back with DJ. Looking to grab some boots. Crimson again rotating out with DJ. On the oh, demolition, good demo on there by Crimson, and there we go. Up We're to off Bender. to the races. It's a two on three, but DJ gaining control, looking to pass back to pass Crimson. Back to Crimson, back to Bender. A little bit of a three man weave oh, going wow. on. DJ up top off the oh, back wow. Can Bender? Bender's gonna finish. No, he can't. Come on. Out front was Kenny, but here's Crimson. Oh, up and top he's goes Briss. Oh, off the backboard, but good disrupted by Lando. There. Man, that was DJ, scary. Yeah, DJ's got it now. Going up against two. Can he punch it in himself? He can't, but Bender's there for the rebound. But met by Briss. And here we go. SNU looking to gain some momentum. Is pushed out front by Lando. But Crimson. Ooh, DJ looking to clear. Good save by Crimson. Briss coming in for the rebound. And the setup. Good oh, save. Oh, good by save Crimson. there by Crimson. Great job. As Kenny again looking to Briss. Briss he's going to get another up. one. Keep him coming, Crimson. The best goalie in the league. Here we go. DJ and now look back to rotate. Oh, and there. Oh, wow. And he's going to score that one. Off the assist from Briss. It looked like Briss kind of wanted that score, but uh, Lando might have uh, taken it a little bit from him. <laughs> he just yes. kind of stole it and hit it in. Snuck in right there underneath him. So SNU will go up 1 to 0 with 330 left in this final game. game as up top goes crimson trying to met by lando but the contest doesn't go brisk in control now southeastern looking to disrupt anything he has going good save uh, by dj and bender yeah brisk again rotating back with some boost now dj they just got to get the ball out of the hands of brisk it's mm -hmm. out of the hands of brisk it's really scary seeing him have the ball there it is wow almost a great setup there by dj crimson just wasn't able to punch it oh, in there wow. Crimson off of his back tires there. A wonderful answer there by Southeastern, as you can see. DJ looking to set something up, and the Crimson with a little redirection, and that'll even Love it up. Love to see Tyler. that. 309 left here in uh, what is game number four. As the kickoff will end up in SC's favor. Kenny Bender going up top, couldn't take it himself. DJ looking to collect it again. Briss. On the disruption there, facing three SNU players. So Crimson's going to meet the ball. 
Crips. Oh, good save by Briss. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, if uh, you guys want to know more about uh, the OAC playoffs and the grand finals, which is on Saturday, um, you can stay up to date in our Discord. Um, and also come out to uh, SWOSU, Swasu, um, where the grand finals will be taking place, as well as there's also an Apex tournament uh, tomorrow. Um, I believe it starts at 10 o'clock and goes until about 1. Um, and it is all high school kids, and we will be streaming the whole event here on SE Sports. So uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Ooh! As so, we get back into the as match. As we get back into the match, as you can see right there, was a great shot on goal by Briss. It was in scary territory oh for God. SE. Oh, my God. And looking to gain control again. Here's DJ pushing it out front. Lando looking to contest. Kenny will get control again. Bender will take it back. Looking for a shot on goal. Ooh, oh, great save by Briss. But here comes Crimson. Oh, and he's going to fake him. Ooh, and DJ. That's what you have to do. When you're up against good teams, communication and great fakes. And here comes DJ looking. He says something up for Bender. Oh, Bender flying into the goal. Get it. As there goes Crimson. Lando looking to, looking to clear out. But DJ again. Then there's Crimson as well. Looking to keep it in SNU side with just a minute 30 to go. Bender went for a shot. But DJ trying to take it himself. But disrupted by Lando. SNU doesn't have, doesn't have many opportunities here to score. Southeastern playing greatly on SNU side of the field, looking for any opportunity they have on goal. And there's, oh, ooh, wow. Good save by that Briss. Was so close there. A little bit of a whiff there by Lando, but Briss able to bring, bring it back and Bender up top looking for the score. One minute remaining. If one more goal here by SE, we could take it home for the finals as a demolition on Briss. That could be huge for Southeastern if they are able to capitalize. DJ and Crimson looking to combo here. Set something up off the backboard. Crimson, ooh, disrupted by Lando. And here we go, Bender. Briss out front, looking to take it on Ariel 40 himself. seconds left. SNU finally. Now, if nobody scores here, then we are going to have to enter an overtime period. Um, and the way that works is it becomes sudden death. First team to score a goal wins. Deep in SNU territory here. Oh, we might not have and to. Oh, what oh, a great save we by so Lando. Close. Bender with a little tap and just doesn't go. And here's DJ looking to flick it himself, but disrupted by Briss, which is 15 seconds left to go. Right in the middle of the field, Lando looking to take control and he's for SNU. Win. Contested by Bender. Ten and here comes Crimson. Left. Looking for Ariel. Anything off the backboard. Can somebody punch it in? No, DJ's looking for boost. Says he might want to take control and just go into overtime here. But no, they're able to keep it up. And here they go, Crimson. Oh, wow, nobody's back. Ooh, but they're oh, looking to keep it up again. Good good center, but Briss and will spike, spike it. it. Yeah. And here we are in over. Sudden death, first team to score wins. <laughs> DJ will end up with a kickoff. Now it is really win or go home for SNU. Yes, it is. Any amount of time will go here, and just until we get a goal in Southeastern Territory, DJ trying to push it out front as Briss and Bender are fighting it off in the left corner. DJ getting as much boost as he can. And here we go. DJ looking for the aerial. Crimson right behind him along with Bender. Oh, but they contest off the backboard. Out. And here's Bender on the backboard now. Oh, but nobody's there to capitalize. Oh, 50-50 there from Crimson and Briss. But it'll end up on South Asian side of the field as oh, DJ wow. with the contest. And Bender looking to have to save it. This could be bad for SC. But they're able to clear Almost a minute into overtime here. Bender looking to push out in front with Kenny. He's the only one back. Chased by Briss. Kenny will pick it up. Bender looking to set something off the backboard. DJ and Kimson are rotating around the back. And there's... Ooh, oh, good wow. save. But they got to rotate back. Yes, they do. They have nobody back. Sorry, right, Bender's back there. Ooh. And Bender's just going to take it. Great job. Gaining the attention he's, of He's going to get a fake in there. <laughs> oh, crossed, him out of, crossed him out of his wheels there for a minute. <laughs> As going up top is Briss and disrupted again by Crimson. Lando again looking to set something up, but nobody said, oh, oh good, good demo. Southeast is going to have to look to capitalize on this. Bender pushing it out front. Briss with the disruption and another demolition by Southeastern. Centering it up. Bender could oh. provide something here. Oh, and nobody left on goal. Briss is going to rotate back. Oh, but it will just land off to the left they side. They literally got us on our feet here, ladies <laughs> and gentlemen. Nothing will fall for Southeastern, unfortunate. Looking to go to two minutes of overtime here. Lando gaining control, but Bender, or excuse me, DJ interrupting it. Briss looking for the clear, oh. but Crimson 
Oh, good shot on goal, but this could be Bender's goal. Bender for the score. Grand finals as your Savage Storm defeats the Crimson Storm. Um, four up to four to zero. zero. Going in, and now we will play um, at Swasu on Saturday. Um, we will either we will either play the winners of OSU or OCU. But Colby, before we leave, we have to go into the player of the game. Bender, the last shot. I'm giving last it to shot. Bender. Okay, I feel like if you if you go offensively, you have to go DJ for the whole series. Okay, <laughs> but if you go defensively, I'm gonna have to give it to Crimson. Crimson. Uh, Crimson yes. was insane on his defensive goal or defensive stops. It, it was unmatched. Yes, he had four or five in a row consecutively. Right. Um, Game number three, man. Everyone on SC was able to rotate back, take turns in the and goal. And communicate in the process. Nobody got overwhelmed. Everybody did what they were supposed to. Just textbook Rocket League esports gameplay. And ladies and gentlemen, if you aren't on your feet, I don't know what will get you there. As we have just won our semifinal game of the OACE playoffs. Ladies and gentlemen, we thank you so much again for being here. We are so thankful for you tuning into the stream. Please, if you feel like you need to support us, thank you for everything you have done. As Southeastern will move in to the grand finals for Rocket League. We'll see you guys on Saturday. Peace out. Everything.